Today we rescued 12 ducks in horrific conditions. Blind ducks with broken wings, broken legs, respiratory issues, pigeon toed, and that's just at first glance. So I posted that video about a year and a half ago after a gas station petting zoo surrendered an entire family of ducks to us in some of the most horrific conditions. The duck is literally missing both of its eyes. And this month we were given the opportunity to rescue a few more animals from the very same place. One of our incredible volunteers was able to convince the owners to sell her his miniature pygmy goat and an injured peahen. It looks like the bone is out of place. See this beautiful peahen has injuries on both sides of her legs. You see both of her outer toes though? For comparison, this is how a normal peahen's legs should look, and this is how this peahen's leg looks. And when she walks, she swings her leg out to the side. There was pigeons on one side, and mostly chickens on the other, and I happened to notice her. I said, you wanna, you wanna sell the peacock too? He said, I was looking for a male peacock. I said, how much? He told me that. He said, 30 bucks. 30 bucks? 30 bucks. So for just $30, we were able to rescue this beautiful peahen from a lifetime of neglect. We can't wait to get her on the path to recovery and see what the x-rays will show with her leg. From here, this story gets a lot harder and you might not want to let the kids watch this one. The next rescue that we took in was a dwarf miniature pygmy goat that the owner said was a milking goat because he didn't realize that she was actually pregnant and due to give birth any moment. We immediately began building a beautiful new house for this new rescue and her new little babies to have a safe space at our sanctuary to call their own. We were so worried that this little girl wouldn't even have enough time to decompress and settle into her new home before she brought her new life into the world. We were also really worried because she's incredibly young and we knew that there was no way that she was even a year old yet. Not even two days after arriving at our sanctuary, she went into labor. Come on, mama, push. Come on, push. Come on, push. Push. Could you feel the hat? It's, she's right, literally right here. Come on, push. I'm feeling it's just like, because the baby's like this, with the head up here. She's stuck. Come on. Push. Push. I won't lie, it's taken me so long to find the right way to end this video because I couldn't even bring myself to put into words what happened. For the first time ever, Kevin and I, alongside some of our incredible volunteers, had to help remove a stillborn baby goat from the inside of this mama. The volunteer that rescued her and brought her here to the sanctuary fell so in love with her that she became her alpha sponsor and she decided to name her Dixie. Dixie has a long journey to recovery ahead of her, but we're just grateful that we were able to rescue her when we did, because if she would have gone through a trauma like this and had been neglected, she would have lost her own life too.